Hello friends, in my this video, I am going to discuss about tilt sensor. Okay, so what do you understand from the name tilt sensor? This is one kind of sensor which can measure that is a system is in its original position or it is tilted. Okay, that means uh, suppose one system is this is the system's original position suppose the system's positions become this or this suppose you are walking in a hill area then uh, this type of tilted road uh, you have to face so to measurement how much tilt or how much bent shape of the uh, of the instrument is there in a particular position we use the sensor which is called tilt sensor okay so here in this video, I will explain the basic concept of the tilt sensor. So how the tilt sensor works. Before going to that, I will just give you a quick overview of closed circuit and open circuit which you have already studied from your class 8 or 9 physics concept. Okay, what is closed circuit? If the circuit is closed and we connect one battery with an LED or lamp, then obviously for closed circuit the uh, LED or the lamp will glow okay so the lamp is glowing in this case because the circuit is closed it is emitting light okay so see here flow of electron is shown from negative to positive so this is called closed circuit now suppose you cut some portion of this circuit and the circuit becomes this now from negative terminal electron will start flowing it will flow through the led and here when it will come at this terminal see there is no way for the electron to complete the cycle or to go to the positive terminal of the battery so as a result as the loop is not completed so what will happen the lamp or the led will not glow okay so this is called open circuit so this is the basic concept that for closed circuit the LED will glow and for open circuit the LED will not glow. Now we will use this concept to measure the tilt. Okay. How? Let us check. We make one circuit. Just simple circuit. Here one resistor is there because we never connect one LED directly with the source we always connect what one resistor for protection of the led diode okay so because LED for led protection is required because led is one kind of diode and if high voltage is applied then the then the led will burn okay so suppose here we apply the battery this is the lamp this is the resistor and this is the battery now Suppose we want to close this circuit in such a way that when the circuit is kept in some horizontal position then the switch will on and if it is some in placed in some tilt position then the switch will become closed. How can we make such kind of switch? That is the main key concept of the tilt sensor. So for that purpose what we do? We place one box here, okay, and uh, we we keep these two terminals of these wires in such a way, and here they are connected. See, up to this position also the circuit is open because the two wires are not connected. Okay, battery is connected, okay, but the loop is not completed, so the LED will not glow. So what do we do now? We take one metallic ball and we place it inside this box. Okay. And if the uh, sensor is in its stable condition, that is, suppose if the sensor is placed in a horizontal uh, surface, then what will happen? The ball will stay exactly in between this box. Okay see the as the ball is metallic so basically it is connecting the two 
terminals of the open ended wires and it is completing the loop and as the loop is completed so obviously the led will turn on but the necessary condition for the led to turn on is that the circuit the path must be closed path so the ball in horizontal surface the ball exactly the ball is uh, situated exactly in between these two wires it is as and as it is metallic so it is completing the loop and the led will glow now let us consider the same situation in an inclined plane then what will happen suppose we keep the same circuit in an inclined plane so this is the box which we have drawn already earlier so here this metallic portions are there but it is open ended now what we do we place one resistor okay so that for protection of diode as you know now here we keep one led or you can say one lamp now what we do we connect the power source or we can say we connect the battery in such a way clear now see as the sensor or the system is placed in an inclined surface what will happen the ball which was initially when it was kept in horizontal surface the ball was in between these two open ended wires but as now the sensor is placed in a inclined plane what will happen i will show you so the new position of the ball by different color see the ball will come here okay the ball will no longer here okay because it is kept in inclined plane so ball will move from here to here okay now see as the ball is in this position so as a result what will happen see the circuit is now open circuit so obviously the led will not glow so basically in this configuration we have achieved such a system which will make the led turn on when the system is kept in an horizontal surface and if the same system is kept in some inclined surface or inclined plane what will happen the system the led will not glow and in this way the system can show that is the uh, surface is horizontal surface or inclined surface okay so this is how the tilt sensor works okay so this is very important concept in electronics and communication engineering for sensor depart department you can buy this sensor and you can do several experiments but you just keep this concept in your mind that before doing any ex experiment with a particular tool or a particular sensor you must know the working principle of the sensor then only you can clearly and properly utilize that sensor okay so this is how the tilt sensor works this is all for my this video and for more videos related to sensors and other important topics of electronics and communication engineering please subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon and if this video is helpful for boosting your concepts please like share and comment thank you for watching